now it's time for a critical look at our pastor's le sermon last Sunday. And here with tonight's lady, Miss G. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you so much for that. And you know, wait a minute. Speak up. You know I can't hear without my glasses. You yep. can't hear anyway, Miss T. Yep. <laughs> wait a minute. These are the wrong ones because these are the ones that's in Greek. Hold on. They read Greek. Just a second. Give me. Oh, okay. Now we got the right one, baby. Good evening, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for joining me today. I'm really alarmed at the lies and deceit being spread by a pastor. In his last sermon, he said, and I quote, <clears throat> Therefore, go and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, and teaching them to obey everything I have commanded you. And surely I am with you always, to the end of the age. <laughs> well, what do you think about that? Well, I think... Of what? That's exactly what it says in the Bible. Ladies and gentlemen, can you see how perverse this attack is on the Bible? Our pastor is even fooling our Nelson now. What do you mean he's fooling me? All right, Mr. Smarty Pants. Okay, so if Jesus really said this, if he really said, surely I will be with you always, what about the rest of us? What are you talking about? Okay, okay, suppose for a minute that Jesus really said, Shirley, I will be with you always. Who is this person named Shirley? Is Jesus talking about just one person named Shirley? Or is he saying that he would only be with people whose name is Shirley? First of all, I looked it up in this concordance. I found a woman named Esther. I found a woman named Ruth. Not Ruth. I found another woman named Priscilla. Not Priscilla. But I couldn't find a single occurrence of the name Shirley. But regardless of why Jesus would say he would only be with women, that is preposterous. It's just another example of our pastor playing fast and loose with the Bible. I think it's time we find ourselves another pastor. There we go with another pastor again. Wait. Wait. Just a minute. Do you mind? I'm doing an editorial here. Listen. Just listen. Matthew 28, 19 and 20 says, Surely I will be with you always. Not surely. If I will be with you always, it's an adverb, not a proper name. Woman to woman. Man to man. If you've ever been in love. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm You're not supposed to be trying to say. Well, never mind. It just brought back a memory. <clears throat>